What is going on ladies and gents, my name is Simply Pops, but you guys can call me Pops, and yet we have another story, it's story time Wednesday, and you guys will enjoy this story, every week, story time, I know I don't do it every week, but I try to, but story, story times always get better and better, but this story here is me talking about the time that I brought vodka to school by accident, so this is pretty much funny. I was in sixth grade, and let's get right into the story. I don't want to spoil it yet. So take a seat, grab something to eat, and enjoy this commentary. So once upon a time, I was in sixth grade. Nah, I'm not going to say it like that. So I was in sixth grade, right? Middle school time. This is the time when I was a freshman in middle school. So I don't know. You know, you start to get prayer pressure, not prayer pressure, but you do start to get a little prayer pressure in sixth grade. But you have a self-esteem where you want to, you know, start liking women, you know, start really thinking about women hard as hell and start dressing up fly and stuff and want to smell fresh. And I do want to smell fresh. I'm not saying I don't smell dirty, but you just start overdoing it, bringing cologne and, you know, bringing deodorant. You bring all this stuff and... I want to smell fresh this day, like extra fresh. I don't know if I would want to impress a girl or I don't know who I wanted to impress, but I do learn from the story too, by the way. And I want to smell fresh. So what I did was I went in my parents' room and I just picked up the smallest thing that was there in their dresser, right? I just wanted to borrow it, you know, use it in school and then come right back home and put it right back. So what I did was I picked up vodka. Now, I thought it was cologne when I was a kid because I didn't really read the bottle. Stupid of me. I, I should have read the bottle, but it was vodka. It was vodka. So I picked it up, put some on my neck. Put someone on my neck and i said wow this thing really smell fresh it's filled nice and strong so it don't wear out so that was the only problem with me with colognes back then is because it just it dries out you stop smelling it so i just liked it this one because it smells strong but i learned my lesson it's never good to wear strong cologne you want something that smells soft not really too soft but not really too harsh and that's what i learned today obviously i'm older now and yeah i learned my lesson so i brung that you know, I got off from gym, put some more on my neck, <laughs> and I went to science class. This is where I got caught in a way, but I didn't know. So my teacher, you know, was standing next to the door. I don't know, because the chalkboard was on the side and the door was right there. We was in the portables. I'm pretty sure you guys know what the portables is. We was in the portable buildings because, you know, I don't know how they did it. But I was there, and then the teacher was spelling, smelling, smelling. And she's just saying, who got on cologne? And I didn't raise my hand. I don't know. I just didn't because I didn't want to be the oddball to raise my hand, only beating the person. She, she actually started sniffing on everybody like a weirdo. I don't know why she did that. She started sniffing on pers people. I said person. And walking around the room smelling on me. And then she started smelling stronger and stronger and stronger near me. And then she said, oh, Sean, what what kind of cologne you use? And I just said, oh, nothing. I just I just use vodka. I just use vodka on my neck. And that's how basically I got caught. I got caught by me. So she was saying she wants to see the bottle. And I'm just saying, yeah, I just use this. Sean, 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 this is, this is alcohol. And she called my parents. And that's how I got caught for bringing vodka to school. So I did not know. I was pretty young, though. Honesty. I was pretty young. But I should have known what was, you know, vodka or something. But that's how I learned about vodka today. Every time I see vodka in a blue bottle, I, it always going to bring back memories no matter what. So that was the story. I got caught on my own lie. And I got in trouble. I went to the principal office. I got all kinds of trouble. But and the funny thing is, I did not know. I didn't know it was alcohol. So I guess the teacher didn't really trust me in a way. But I don't know. I got caught. And that's really the story. I hope you guys really did laugh. And yeah, I'm pretty much done. If, leave a like if you did enjoy the story. If you're new around here, please subscribe for more stories. I have a lot of stories to go. I've been through such a lot. And yeah. Follow me on Twitter, check out the previous video on screen, and I'm out. Peace.